Um, well, Ryan, here we are. Six round stoppage. Uh, you had him down twice. How did it go from your point of view? Yeah, yeah, it went well. Uh, I was going back to corner and Dave was saying don't neglect his body. Um, probably neglected it a little bit bit much, but I think having six, seven months out, I think I uh, shook off a bit of ring rust as well. But I kept going back and Dave was telling me body shots and I was trying them even more as the rounds were going on. And then round, uh, round six, I caught me a fantastic body shot. I think a couple of sh combinations before, but the body shot took it completely out of him. Mm. Were a tough opponent, should have listened though. to Dave a bit more. It was a tough opponent though, wasn't he? I mean, uh, you've got to give the guy credit. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, he's boxed for world titles, boxed for European titles. They bring in, I think he brought 40 screaming Italians. So there's no way we're going to just lay over and, and take what I was willing to give. He, he took it and came back with his own shots. You were throwing some huge, heavy punches. and I mean, you took him down twice. Uh, you know, I, I, I think a lot of people were amazed that he lasted as long as he did, were you? Absolutely. I mean, in training, I've been chucking my right hands and Dave's, you know, Dave said... You know, Dave said three weeks ago, if, if I hit him with a right hand, there's no way he's taking it. And the gloves I wore tonight, Hatton's gloves tonight, they was amazing. There was, there was no, honestly, they were the best gloves I've wore. And I was thinking to myself, when I was on the pads in the uh, changing rooms, if I hit him with this right hand, he's going to go. And I was hitting him with the right hands, and not only was he taking him, he was coming back with shots. And fair play to him, I took me out of to him. You know, tough, tough kid, and, and such a nice fella as well. Tonight, I use my feet, I use my speed, and I think I can count on one hand how many times he hit me. In terms of the support you had in there, some legends of boxing there. I mean, obviously, Ricky was there, but you, you made Naz turn Yeah, up. Naz came up. Got a, I got a phone call off him a couple of weeks ago. He uh, said he was trying to come up. Um, I, had a, I had a telephone call this afternoon. Well, a text this afternoon. Uh, give me a call. So I phoned him. I says, what's up? You got no credit? But now he's sort of laughing. He says, no, I've tried to call you, but he's been engaged. So he says, I'm on my way, don't worry, I said I'd be there and, and I'll be there. And like you said, Ricky out and there as well, absolutely fantastic promotion tonight. Obviously fans have had to wait seven months to get you back in the ring. Are we going to have a long wait for your next fight? Not a chance. Like I said, I've got to sit down with a few different people and uh, plan a path which way we're going to take. But hopefully in the next couple of, couple of weeks we'll discuss which, which route we're going to take.